Hello everybody, welcome to Transy Learning Chemistry videos. In this video, we'll be explaining the question shown that is out of phenol and methanol, which one is a stronger acid and why. Here you can see I have written two structures. The first one that is CH3OH is methanol, whereas this one that is C6H5OH is phenol. So out of phenol and methanol, the stronger acid is phenol. Why? What is the reason behind it? What justification we can give for this answer? Let's study about that in this video. First of all, we should understand what is meant by acidic strength. The acidic strength of the compound is the ease with which it loses its proton or hydrogen ion. You can see here that the phenol has a tendency to lose this proton whereas methanol also has a tendency to reach this proton. So the acidic strength depends upon the ease of removal of hydrogen ion and it is directly proportional to it. That means if a compound loses proton easily it is more acidic in nature as compared to the one which loses proton with difficulty. So as I have told you that phenol Phenol is more acidic as compared to methanol. That means phenol has a tendency to lose this proton easily as compared to methanol. But what is the reason behind it? For that, we have to understand on what factors the acidic strength and the ease of removal of hydrogen ion depends. The acidic strength depends upon the type of atom or group attached to the compound. So there are two types of group. EWG stands for electron withdrawing group and this group or atom is always more electronegative than the carbon chain. And ERG stands for electron releasing group and this group is always less electronegative than carbon chain. You can see here that the electron withdrawing group is attached to the carbon chain. So now as this group is more electronegative as compared to the carbon chain, so it will withdraw the electrons towards itself and this will lead to minus I effect. Now due to this effect and this group being more electronegative, there is attraction of the electrons towards this group. So there will be dispersion of the negative charge on this anion. So due to the dispersion or the spreading of the negative charge on this ion, this anion will become stable. And due to there's the force of attraction between this anion and the proton, will decrease. The removal of this proton will become easy. There's the acidic strength will increase. So we can conclude that the electron withdrawing group dispersed the negative charge on the anion thereby making the anion stable. So the acidic strength is directly proportional to the presence of electron withdrawing group. That is the group which shows minus I effect. So the presence of electron withdrawing group increases the acidic strength of the compound. Whereas in this case of electron releasing group, this group is less electronegative as compared to the carbon chain. So due to the it will donate the electrons towards the carbon chain and this will lead to plus I effect. Due to this effect there is accumulation of the negative charge on this anion and due to increase in the negative charge on this anion the force of attraction between this anion and the proton will increase which will make the removal of this proton difficult. So we can conclude that the electron releasing group increases the negative charge on the anion thereby making it unstable. That means acidic strength is inversely proportional to the presence of electron releasing group that is plus I effect. So the presence of electron releasing group decreases the acidic strength. Now we have understood how the acidic strength varies with the presence of electron withdrawing group and the electron releasing group. Now let us understand in terms of phenol and methanol. In case of phenol, this phenyl group is electron withdrawing group. That means it will show minus I effect. Thus due to this effect, it will withdraw the electrons towards itself. Due to that, there will be a spreading or the dispersion of the negative charge on this 
phenoxide ion. Now what is phenoxide ion? The phenyl group along with oxygen having the negative charge, this is the phenoxide ion. And due to the minus I effect of their phenyl group, there is dispersion of their negative charge. Due to that, the force of attraction between this negatively charged anion and the proton will decrease, which makes phenol acidic. While in case of methanol, this methyl group is electron releasing group and it will donate electrons towards the oxygen atom of the hydroxyl group and this will lead to plus I effect. Due to this effect there is accumulation of electrons on the oxygen atom. Thus this methyl group makes the methoxide ion. This is methoxide ion unstable and due to accumulation of the negative charge on the oxygen atom the force of attraction between this anion and the proton increases which makes the removal of this proton difficult. Thus we can conclude that phenol is more acidic as compared to methanol. Thank you very much for watching this video. For more videos you can visit our website transelearning.com. Have a great day.